What's up guys, Nick here, and in today's video, I wanted to do a quick tutorial on how to butterfly a bait fish. Now, butterflying a bait fish is a really good tactic and technique to use if you are bottom fishing and you don't have any live bait. However, maybe you have some frozen bait, and I'll tell you why after I show you how to do it. So let's go ahead and hop on the GoPro so I can show you exactly how to butterfly a bait. Alrighty guys, what I'm doing here is what they call butterflying a bait. This is a blue runner, and all you do is you will grab your fillet knife, start at the tail, and then you will just kind of fillet up the back of its spine until you get to about where the dorsal fin is. And then I will just cut through his chin. And then once you have that, you just tear out his spine like that. So you got a couple pieces of chum there, and then you have a nice butterflied blue runner. This is good for grouper, snapper, really big game fish. And then what we do is we just hook him right through the bottom of the mouth, through the cartilage, and send him down, and hopefully a big old grouper grabs a hold of him. So I hope that tutorial was easy for you guys. I know a lot of people will actually butterfly the bait from the head going backwards, but I've just found that going from the tail up to the head actually allows me to be able to feel the spine a little bit easier and just overall seems to work a little bit better for me. Now, butterflying a bait to drop down to the bottom can be really good for some big grouper, some big snapper. You can even troll with it if you put it behind a skirt. So there's really a lot of applications for it. And if you guys have any questions about this particular technique, let me know down in the comments below. I'll be make sure to answer those for you. And if there's anything else that you might want to learn how to do, let me know because I love learning and I also love teaching other people to make them be able to be better anglers and to catch more fish. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and until the next one, I hope you're able to get out on the water and catch some fish.